here we are on natural gas. Just got into a trade here at uh, 17.55. We bonafide and ratified. Uh, we're within a margin of error here for the top, but we've got a dot on the three and a dot on the two. I might even load this up with an extra dot here. It looks really good. Natural gas has recently been coming on down. Uh, we had a big peak on the 15 minute, went all the way up to pivot and has been coming down. So let's see if this thing will work. Ideally, we want to get first target is going to be the 7.5 and that'll give us 50 bucks. And then after that, I got this pivot down here at 7.1740. So that's our ultimate goal, but maybe I won't want to apply here. Let's just see what happens. Bonafide ratified and it is certified. I'm going to be in with three contracts if we get them. Because, oh yeah, I better set my stop here. You see, there's obviously some resistance right here. 176. So I'll go up that just a tad. 6-1. And we just wait and see. We're back into close proximity here. Down 20. We're up 50 for the day. I had another call earlier on natural gas that we were at 70 with. A little cushion. Little shooting star there. We're going to bring it down, but we got this dot on three and dot on two. And we got a dot on the 15, but we are three way unit. I am going to move this right there at 17.55. If it comes down, we'll get in with other contracts there. I just had this. I think we're going to make it to the fiber for sure. <clears throat> and the way this is setting up, I think we're going to get full retracement here. It's gone all the way up here to the pivot. I think we're going to come back down to this pivot. That's what the dot is saying. So we're going to have to believe that dot. Almost made a zero line rejection here. was off by a few minutes, but the curve was good. It's just it took, and that's typical for natural gas. It usually moves slower, but it's usually more deliberate. So that's what we like. Let's see if we can get in and enjoy the ride. It's going to be top of the hour, unfortunately, here in just a little bit. I was hoping by the top of the hour I'd be at this uh, $50 profit. Top of the hour, natural gas has more of a tendency to move at tops of the hour. And here we had bonafide dot here, bonafide, and then it got, or here's the bonafide, and it did get ratified. My problem was with this one getting in on going up was with that big shooting star on the 15, I really th think it's coming down, but number two, we had the Fibonacci five. One, two, three, four, five candles going up. When you got five candles in a row like that, all of them progressively getting a little bit bigger than the one before, it makes you wonder if we're going to have a retracement. Profit takers. And so that's Fibonacci 5. You can see then after that we got some shooting star action here and then some long dojis. So you put all that together and that tells you that it's probably going to be coming down sooner or later. So I'm glad I didn't get in on the, the up here. Could have got in at 62. Uh oh, we just got in it with two more contracts. We're in on three. So our first target's here at 1750. So we're going to get out of one of the contracts here. If it gets down there, we'll that be enough to cover our commissions on everything. So that's kind of our goal. We can see what income where we're starting to see increased at 959, increase of contracts. That's good. Let's see if it can bring it down all the way to the fire. That's the goal for goal number one. Again, target two is going to be 1740. The next target after that is probably 1730. Uh oh, going the wrong way. And on three contracts, can't go the way too far. Or we're going to be very, very angry. So let's see if the eight can keep it down. Another stop right there. We'll put in all three of our stops here. Go 59, 60, 61. We've got three stops. And we're getting close, getting close to our first target being hit. Let's see if we go. Here we come. Do, 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 do. Okay, target one's been hit and through. So we're going to bring, take one of those stops out. And I'm going to bring one of these stops into prop. Well, I thought it was. Yep, stop for profit for 10 bucks. So now we're guaranteed we're going to be a 60. And I'll bring this one down here just it even so guaranteed to get 60 bucks out of this thing so that's an average of 20 bucks a contract and i expect this thing going to go on down to the 40 now let's see what happens we've gone through the 200 we've gone through the fiver here we come here we come here we come 
We are going to set the next stop here at the 40, right there. Okay. Right now, everything going. We're up $290 for the day. If we got out right now, at 70 to start with. We got 50 times 3, 150, and then we got 20 times 2 here. Come on now. Come on now. You can do it. Right now, we got $120 in the two contracts, 60 bucks a piece. I think we can go. Come on, let's bring her down. Bring her down. 1740, 1740, 1740. Hit. Let's go. Come on. Bring her down. Bring her down. Bring her down. Bring her down. Hit. All right. Can't talk it into it. It's going to take its own sweet time. I might be getting out of everything at 1750 if it goes up there just a little bit higher. Let's see what the cards have in play right now. See, we had one, two, three. Fibonacci three, and then it retraced just a little bit. Where here we had those five. The five in a row going up, you almost have to have some retracement. So that's why I wanted to wait. Now, if we would have got a dot here, I would have got in on that one. But because it didn't get the dot here and the dot moved over, there was a flasher, but it moved over, and so I had to wait for here. I could have went ahead and jumped in it, but, uh, you know, 58 to... Uh, to get up to 64, you know, that would have been okay. It would have been $60. But uh, I just didn't like the feel of it when it was because the dot moved over. That's why I didn't get in on that trade going up. All right, come on now. Come on now. Here we come. Come on now, you buzz little buzzard beater. This is when it gets a little nerve-wracking. Okay, the eight is sitting here at five one, so I'm going to bring this stop down to five two. Okay, so we want to bring that stop just above. Let that eight play out, give it enough room. Sometimes, like right now, we're getting some retracement. People taking profit from those previous three candles dropping, so people will take profit, get that 50, 60, 70 dollars. So we want to let them go ahead, and then we're going to hope that we continue down. Let's see what happens. Not really a bet and betty, but we did go up to almost the eight and come back down. So at this point in time, we do expect a continuation. Everything you look at the dot lines here, the safe day trading dot lines are getting staying way far, way far apart. And it can, you know, look at here and how far apart it was, and it just kind of continues to divert and get further apart. But so at this point in time, we're at that 47 mark, and I expect it to, to drop. If it goes all the way down to 40, it's a whole other story. But I expect us to drop. You know, the eight has come down to the fiver. It's continuing to work for us. Obviously, we still have the dot dot lines on two and three continue to get further apart Ooh, it wasn't good but it did go up and touch the eight let's see it then bounced right back bounced right back now we've got a bet and betty set up right here at four six if you weren't in before now we can get in at four six now as the next potential entry point you can get in at four six and your goal would be the first step is to go to 40. to go to this well it'd be four one we gotta take a look at that four one is actually where the pivot is so that may be a better target place at 4-1 if it gives us any hesitation but nice shooting star there off of that bouncing off the eight gives me more confidence let's see if we get it all right see we can get down near the four six one more time it's been back and touched that eight a few times now so we're going to bring our stop into a little bit more profit here and just we're going to take this one down to the fiver. If it does retrace back, all three contracts, we're going to get 130, 140, 50 contract. But now, now we're buzzing here. We got $200 dollars on each one. Let's see if we can hit to that 40. Okay, I'm going to bring this stop. The eight is up here at 1747. So I'm going to bring this stop to 48. Now we've got 150, 170 dollars guaranteed on that trade between the three contracts. And let's just go ahead and put this one, the third stop. Well, let's see, we start at 56. At that third contract, we'll go for 34, get 310 dollars on it. 
Okay, retraced here quite a bit, but not to the eight. You can see that eight starting to fade. Dot lines are getting a little bit closer, but not too bad yet. As long as we stay above that eight, we're safe, I believe. And if it goes above there and we're out, we got profit, so we won't be hurting too bad. Come on down, you buzzard. There we come. There we come. Gotta like it. Gotta like it. Gotta like it. We're at 350 for the day, right? Now, see, here's an up deal. We got the hammer, but it, the hammer didn't ever certify that it was an up move. So we came in with the hammer and almost engulfed him back. So this just happens to be a candle. We can't call it a hammer. Okay, I'm going to move this stop into 47. Follow it up. You see the turbos are all still staying down, all three. And even the 15s come all the way through the zero line now. So I've got confidence it's going down. It's, this is the third candle down with that shooting star mentality there on this last candle. but. Let's see if we can get it just to come down a hair further and then maybe give us two more and for five in a row down and get past that pivot. Mm -mm. That ain't good. Is that going to be an engulfing? Touch the eight one more time. And back down she comes. There we go. Come on. Okay, getting closer here. 1742, the 8 still at 44. We can bring our stop a little bit closer. I can bring a stop down to 45 on one of them here. Yeah, we'll save that time. That red candle came down. We're back. Yeah, 1741 is bouncing off that pivot one more time. We've hit it twice. I could have probably got out there at 1741. Bring that second stop down to 46. The 8 is now at 43. Dilemmas, dilemmas, dilemmas. That line is definitely getting closer together now. 8 still cutting down. Turbo is still down on all three. So it makes me lean into the holding on mode. Right now we're up 390 for the day on natural gas. Two trades completed, two trades we're still in. One again, it got to the pivot. Once again, it bounced a little. Hmm. There we go, got taken, giddy up. All right, so we get to take out another one of these stops on the back end. And our goal now is, right now we're still at 1734, about $440. Stop is out for the eight is now at 43, so I'm going to bring that stop down to 43 right now. It looks like we're still going to go down a little. Come on now, come on now, come on down. I'm up 170, 180 dollars on this last contract. I'd like to make it an even 200, guess a 1735 would be 200 dollars on that one. I don't see anything down here except. We got down before to 1737, and that's where we are right now. So we're kind of at a double bottom. Oh, got him. Holy smokies. Took him right out of there. So we'll get rid of that stop. We ended up with $510 there uh, total for the day on natural gas, four trades. And we were up 70 before. Look at that. Look at that. There's room for it to go. But there you go. We had uh, 510. Our dot here, which was just barely legal, and the main reason that I chose it to be legal again is because the two-minute and the three-minute dots were completely legal and going down too. So that's what we got it with. $510 for the day, four trades. Giddy up and go. When you follow the dot, you will make a lot.